Hello, good evening. Good evening. Hello, Alfa. Hello, Morena. Hello, Mario. Welcome to the class. How are you tonight? How fine. are you? I'm fine. Okay, very good. Fine. You're fine. Thank you, Andrew. I'm excellent. Thanks for asking me. It's nice to see you today. So yesterday we were studying which topic? Do you remember what was yesterday's topic? What was the topic for yesterday? Very irregular. Thank you very much. It's with the simple pass using irregular verbs. And that is what we had been studying verbs in simple past tense. And let me ask you about the platform. ¿Cómo van en la plataforma? Eh, very good. Me, 40, 44. Good. 45. 45. Uh -huh. El 4.4, oh. me quedé. Ah, ok, no excelente. Excellent, you are in the section number four. That is the section for this week. So don't worry, you are doing good. Eh, la Pero me cuatro. costó, me quedé a media. Really? Bueno, si encuentran alguna dificultad, no se olvide que podemos ayudarle. ¿verdad? Usted escribe en el grupo de WhatsApp y con gusto nosotros les ayudamos. ¿De acuerdo? Ok, thank you. Okay. En su caso, Luis, Mario y Morena. ¿En qué sección están trabajando en la plataforma? Section 4. Section 4. Ok, very good. En Luis. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening, Luis. Welcome to the class. In my case, I, I didn't work today uh, the lesson 4 because I didn't have time. Okay, don't worry about that. You are going to have, you still have time, right? Um, tomorrow yeah, yeah. and the day after tomorrow, right? So don't worry about that. Yeah. Okay, so don't forget about those exercises. It is important, right? It is important for you to get your diploma. So you have to accomplish at least the 80%. Tiene que lograr por lo menos el 80%. Don't forget about that, right? Ya solo nos viene quedando una semana. Después le va a tocar desvelarse conmigo hasta las 12. Rellenando, <risa> rellenando Llena. toda la... No, mejor rellenar, Miguel, ahí le, ahí le mando la respuesta. <risa> rellenando toda la plataforma. Entonces vamos haciéndolo despacio. Todavía tenemos tiempo. Ok. ¿Hasta so, cuándo tenemos, ficha? Hasta el próximo miércoles. Este miércoles. O sea que tenemos que terminar la plataforma este fin de semana. Ah, así es, si sí, no le va a quedar tiempo lunes, martes y miércoles el fin de semana, porque el miércoles es el último día okay. don't forget about those dates so let's start with a practice let's see here share this He's here we go so yesterday we were studying irregular birds and also we studied irregular birds in so look at this. Can you please uh, help me to say in a sentence using the following verbs? Oh, this is an easy one. This is a regular verb. Dance. Dance. Uh, what is the fast of this verb? Is danced. Danced. So can you tell me a sentence, an affirmative sentence in simple past? Tell me an example. Danced. I danced yesterday. So I danced yesterday. So easy, right? A subject, the very simple past, and the complement. Now I want to make this sentence negative. Quiero hacer esta oración negativa. I want to make this sentence negative. I didn't dance. I didn't dance. So I need to add this didn't. I didn't dance yesterday. I didn't dance yesterday. I didn't dance yesterday. Very good. Now I want to know if you danced yesterday. What is the question? What is the question? 
Did you dance yesterday? Thank you very much. Did you dance yesterday? Very good. That is the right sentence. Did you dance yesterday? And what is missing here? The question mark. Did you dance yesterday? What is a possible answer? Morena, did you dance yesterday? Um, yes, yes, I did. Okay, excellent. So you say, yes, I did. That is an affirmative answer. And a negative answer is, no, I? No, I don't. I didn't. didn't. No, I didn't. Very good. No, I didn't. Good evening. I'm sorry Hello. to be late. Don't worry, Cidro. Welcome to the class. Thank you very much, teacher. Okay, now I have here the three type of sentences. Affirmative sentences, I danced yesterday. A negative sentence, I didn't dance yesterday. And the interrogative sentences, did you dance yesterday? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. So let's do another example. Do you remember about some irregular verbs? To make this example, let's see, sleep. The verb sleep in simple past, sleep. Yes. Sleep. 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 That's a regular verb. Yes, it is an irregular verb. So sleep. Sleep. So. Irregular oh. verb. So an affirmative sentence. Can you help me with an affirmative sentence? Uh, I. My sister. Sleep. We can say, for example, I slept late yesterday. Me dormí tarde ayer. I slept late yesterday. Oh, I slept during the class. Me dormí durante la clase yesterday. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. I hope. Now let's write this sentence in negative. Let's make this negative. ¿Qué necesito para hacer la negativa? I didn't. didn't. Ah, ok, excelente. I didn't. I didn't. Slept o sleep? Slept. Sleep. Sleep. I didn't sleep late yesterday. Ah, late. Uh -huh. I didn't sleep late sleep. yesterday. Uh -huh. Now the question. Did you... Sleep late yesterday. Uh -huh. And the question mark. Did you sleep late yesterday, Morena? Yes, yes, I, yes, I did. Oh, yes, I did. Okay. <laughs> uh, what about you, Julio? Did you sleep late yesterday? Yes. No. No. I say no, I. No. I didn't. No, I didn't. Excellent. Very good. So, así hacemos los tres tipos de oraciones. Affirmative sentences, negative sentences, and question. And this is a yes, no question. And tonight we're going to study information questions. Este es, um, generalmente le decimos en español, pregunta cerrada. Usted solo tiene dos opciones de respuesta. Que son yes o no. And that's why the name, yes, no question. But information question, using the information word. ¿Cuáles son las WH words? ¿Se acuerdan? WH word. In English. Where, where, okay. where is when, one? When, why is another when, one? When. When is another one? Yeah. Who? Who? You say who? How? How? Who? who? How? Which? How? Which? Okay, which? Which? Which one? Okay, where, why, when, who, how, which? Also, we can include how many? Uh, when, when, and also? How much? How, how much? much? How much? How many and how much? Then we are going to learn questions using this work. Estas, estas, nos, estas palabras nos permiten Preguntar por información, por ejemplo, where significa dónde, nos pregunta por un 
lugar. Por un lugar, excelente. Why? ¿Por qué? Nos pregunta por, por una razón. Por una razón. When? Nos pregunta por cuándo. Cuando. Tiempo. Por tiempo. Un tiempo específico. Who? Nos pregunta por una per persona. Por una por persona. Who? Who? And how? ¿Cómo? ¿Verdad? Which, cuando, cuando tenemos opciones, which, cuál, how many, cuánto, and how much, cuánto también. ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre how many and how much? Do you remember that? I'm pretty sure that you studied that in the, the model number two. Uh, the different are the because of one is countable and the other one is incountable. Okay, excellent, very good. How many is for countable things and how much is for incountable nouns? Uh, how many countable nouns and how much are countable nouns? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, no so, es contable, el agua. Uh, así es, so how el much leche. water, uh -huh. how much water do you want? How much meal do you want? How many oranges do you want? But we're going to learn the simple past using this. Here we go. Just a second. I'm going to share the presentation of tonight with you. Just in a second. Here we go. And also we are going to have a reading practice tonight. So that's why the topic that happened last weekend. ¿Qué sucedió el fin de pasado? Or oh, what did you do last weekend? ¿Qué hizo el fin de semana? Pasado. So this is the, let me know, please, if you can see my screen. Yes. Thank you, Magdalena. Just a second. I can't see it yet. What happened with this? It is not working today. What? I can't see it. I can see it. I just can see it in black, my screen. Oh, here we go. Now it is okay. working. Now it is working. Yeah, we are, so. we are watching it. We are watching it. Ah, okay, so weekend stories. This is uh, reading. Very, very <laughs> sorry. Reading. Okay, so simple past information question. We are going to use this structure to make this information question. We are going to need a W word, uh, what, where, when, why, who, which, how much, how many, the with at the beginning of the question. Then what? we are going to need the auxiliary did subject, the subject, the verb in present, don't forget about this, the verb is in present, complement and the question mark. So look at the following examples. When did he live? When did he live? It's asking for time, right? When, it's asking for a day or a specific time. When did he live? So we have the WH word, the auxiliary did, Subject in the verb. ¿Cuándo se fue? ¿A qué hora salió? ¿Cuándo salió? So let's see, where did she go? Where did she go? Where is the WH work? Auxiliary did. Subject she. The verb in present is go. So where did she go? La televisión. It's asking for a place. Where did she go? ¿A dónde fue ella? ¿Dónde fue ella? The next one, what did you study yesterday? What did you study yesterday? What did you study yesterday? I'm going to fix this. It's a yes, yesterday. It's yesterday in this. The next example is why did we cry yesterday? yesterday. Here is it. So, what did you study yesterday? Why did we cry? Asking for a reason. ¿Por qué lloramos nosotros? And who, sí, did, who did you visit yesterday? 
¿A quién visitaste sure. ayer? Yes. And all of my friends, I'm very sorry with all of you, but I had to leave to you because really I want to watch the football game. El Salvador. Between oh, Canada, I'm sorry. Uh, oh. <laughs> I'm very sorry. <laughs> uh, you can watch the, se the second half. The no, second no, half no. of the game. Second half. <laughs> Puede ver la segunda mitad, right? The half of the game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> so, like this. I have the answer okay. for this question. Uh, can you please tell me what is the right answer for the first one? When did he leave? Look, look for the right answer and decide. He left at 11 p.m. Thank you very much. That is the right answer. You're right, very good. He left at she 11 left at p.m. PM. The next, where did she go? She went to the morning. Uh, I think, no, I Excellent. My grand, grandma. Mm, I visited my grandma. Mm -mm, that is no. not the right answer for the second one. The second answer is... He went to the mall. He went, went, she went, she went to the mall. Excellent. Let's see the next one. What did you study yesterday? What did you study yesterday? I studied math and science. Excellent. I studied math and science. And the next one, why did we cry? Because we lost the game. Because we lost the game, porque perdimos el juego. Uh, who did you visit it yesterday? Who did you visit yesterday? Uh, ¿A quién visitaste ayer? I visited my grandma. I visited my grandma. Okay. I visited my grandma. So look at this. Um, we have to give information to answer this type of question. We can say yes or not. We have to get information. So look at the following example. Uh, how fast can you answer the following seven questions? Let's start with number one. What did you cook yesterday? What did you cook yesterday? The, the question is for the ladies. Uh, it's also for men. It's also for men. So what did, did you cook yesterday? <laughs> I did cook. Okay, I did cook. Yo sí I cociné. Did cook. Very good, Luis. Yo sí cociné. I did cook. I yo sí cociné. So what did you cook yesterday? It's an information question. ¿Qué cocinó ayer? Then you say, I cook. I cooked. I cooked. And you say the thing that you cook yesterday. Any I answer? did pupusas yesterday. No, oh. no calentó. <laughs> 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 Solo las calentó, no las hizo. Lo <laughs> ah, okay. <O> más seguro. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure that that happened, right? <laughs> So I cook chicken, for example. I cook beans. Cociné frijoles. What about the next one? ¿Se acuerdan? What did you eat for breakfast this morning? What did you eat for breakfast? Sandwich. Um, okay, very good. So I ate I, I sandwiches. Ate sandwiches. I ate sandwiches. I ate sandwiches. Very good. Any other answer? What did you eat for breakfast? I ate uh, egg, beans. I ate eggs, cheese. beans, and? and cheese. Okay, eggs, beans, and cheese. Very good. And, Excellent answer. And a cup of coffee. And a cup of coffee. Very good. Let's see the next one. When did you last tell a lie? 
¿Cuándo fue la última vez que dijo una mentira? When did you last tell a lie? Tuesday. Tuesday in, in the morning. Ok. <laughs> so you say, I told, I told a lie today morning. Today morning. Excellent. Very sincere, right? You are very sincere. I told a lie today morning. Let's when everybody one. say, eh, la selecta is going to win. <laughs> oh, um, that is a lie, right? Big lie. <laughs> what did you have for dinner yesterday? Do you remember that? What did you have for dinner yesterday? ¿Qué se no ayer? Do you remember? So you say, I had. El pasado del verbo have. I had. You say, I had pupusas, I had pizza, I, have. I had meat. What did you have for dinner? Yes, sweet beans. Oh, <laughs> sweet bean salt. I had sweet bean salt. So, very good. Any other answer? What did you have for dinner yesterday? Any other answer? Um, I had I have a grill grill beef okay very good uh, carne with that beef and uh, the next one what did you watch on TV last weekend do you remember that what did you watch on TV last weekend then you say in past I watched I watched and you say that. What did you watch on TV last weekend? I watched um, Dragon Ball Z. Excellent. <laughs> I watched Dragon Ball Z. Thank you. Any other answer? That was a nice answer. Any other? I didn't watch TV. Excellent sentence to excellent answer. I didn't watch TV. Perfect. Any other answer? The last for this question. What did you watch on TV last weekend? And you say, I watch. I watch. Por porque no meten un gol, señores. Está pendiente. Está How did you get to work today? How did you get to work today? ¿Cómo llegó a su trabajo el día de hoy? You say, I got to work by... I I by, the by car. Ok, you say, I took the bus. I took the bus. I got to work by bus. You can say to I got to work by bus. I got to work uh, in my car. Or I drove my car to work. I drove my car. I, I drove. I, I drove my car. Motorcycle. Okay, excellent. It's I cool. rode. In this case, si es moto, it's road. I rode my motorcycle. Ah, es cierto, es cierto. Porque lo, la monta, ¿verdad? Yes. I rode my motorcycle. I rode my motorcycle. Like a bicycle, I rode my bike. My bicycle. Or my bicycle. My so, bike. <laughs> What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? So tell me some sentences. I about... went to work. Excellent. Excellent sentence. I went to work. And I came, and I came very late yesterday at night. Okay. I came home very late at night yesterday. Thank you. Anyone? What did you do yesterday? I think I'm okay. Can you please repeat your sentence, Senia, please? I study, I study English. I, I study, ¿cómo eh, se dice? Yo canto en el karaoke. Um, I sing uh, karaoke. I, okay, I no. sang. I sang. I sang. I sang a song. I sang on, karaoke. I sang on the karaoke. I sang on the karaoke. I sang on the karaoke. Thank you. I studied English. Very good sentence, Isidro, too. 
Thank you. I studied English. Any yes. other answer? What did you do yesterday? I am sure that you did a lot of activities yesterday. So I went to work, I took a shower, I had a breakfast, I cook, um, I had- I did my, my homework. I, I did, did my, my homework. homework. I watched, I watched TV, I listened- I watched TV. To music, I listened to music, I talk, uh, I talked with my friends, I send the text. So a lot of things, right? I checked my smartphone. I played on my smartphone. So a lot of activities that probably you did I watched yesterday. TikTok. Okay, I watched TikTok videos. Perfect. Now let's see, organize the following verse according to the correct ED pronunciation. Do you remember these? All of them are regular birds, and we're going to order them according its pronunciation. So with T sound, which one are with T sound of this bird? Is it loud, weighted, light, decided, cold, enjoyed, relaxed, started, kissed, smiled, invited, and ride? Which of them are with T sound? Arrive. Love it. Loved. 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 Waited. Liked. Decided. Called. Enjoyed, relaxed, started, kissed, smiled, invited, arrived. So which one? All of them. All of, All them. of them. All of them are with T ah. sound? No. Y nosotros buscando cuál? Buscando cuál? Okay, light is one. Excellent. Light. Light. Una pregunta psicológica. Relaxed. <laughs> relaxed. Relaxed. Excellent. Relax. And which other one? Um, <laughs> Mi amore. Hola. Todas ellas. Todas ellas. Yeah. All of them. Uh -oh. <laughs> Look at this. This is the amore sigue buscando. <laughs> Todas ellas. This is the first one. Light. <laughs> The next one is Kiss. relaxed. También. Okay, kissed. Yes, kissed. <laughs> Very good. Kissed is the other one. What about with this sound? With this sound? Love. Cold. Love. Enjoyed. Cold. 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 Enjoyed. Relaxed. No, 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 smiled, smiled, and invited. No, sorry, start, start, right now, started, it's me, it's started, all right, is the other one, all right, all right. Right. All right. right. Now with it sound, right. the last que sobran, right? We have waited, right. waited, decided, decided, decided. decided. started, decided. Invited. invited, and invited. Very good. So any volunteer to try to pronounce the ed sound in this order, the t sound, d sound, and it sound. Any volunteer tonight? Any volunteer, un voluntario para intentar pronunciar estos verbos con el sonido de ED. Yo. Thank you. Uno cada uno. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Like. Like. Um, relax. ¿Qué es Love. Collie. 
enjoy smiles. Um, why that? Dicey that started invited. Thank you very much. That was a very good try. In this case, we don't say like it, we say light. Light. Like. La EBS. Light. La EBS se convierte light. en este sonido. Light. With T. Light. Re relaxed. Relaxed. Kissed. 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 En los siguientes, loved. Cold, enjoyed, smiled, smiled, waited, decided, started, invited, invited, invited. Thank you very much. I can see that you remember these. Waited. Now, now let's see. Error correction. In the following sentences, it is a mistake, right? And you are going to discover what is the mistake. ¿Por qué está mala esa oración? Why this sentence is in good? Deber. Está usando el auxiliar y está en, en pasado el verbo irregular. Oh, thank It's you very much. much. Okay, ¿cómo sería oh, entonces la oración correcta? Sing. Paulina sang. Sang. No. Very well. That is an option. Paulina oh, no. sang very no. well. Paulina oh, no. did Paulina didn't sing very well. Paulina didn't sing. That very is the other well. option. Very well. Very good. Sorry. Uh, Paulina uh, didn't sing very well. Oh, Paulina sang very well. Excellent. And the next one, Mike wore a beautiful jacket on his birthday. What is the mistake? Mike wear a beautiful jacket on his birthday. What is the mistake in the sentence? Someone has any idea? Tell me if you have any idea. Only Mike wear a beautiful jacket on his birthday. Okay. Yeah. Well, what is the mistake? Mike did, didn't wear didn't wear mm -mm. a beautiful jacket on this birthday okay se dan por vencidos that is not the reason but thank you Luis very good try wear 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 excellent the bear the bear is the problem in the sentence eh, where es un verbo irregular, entonces no le agregamos ed. El pasado de where es word. 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 Very good. Thank you. Let's go with the next one. Where did you found that money? What is the mistake in this question? The where bear. did you found that money? The bear. The bear the again, bear. right? It must be in <laughs> present. So find. Where did you find that money? Did Oscar Wilde wrote many novels? The pair. The pair too, right? It <laughs> must be in present. So write. Did, did Oscar Wilde write many novels? <laughs> Albert didn't drink any alcohol. Albert didn't drink bird. any alcohol. The pair again. The right? same with the entry. first one. The same the number five problem the same as with the first one. one. Yes. I'll... And... Yes. You have you two options. Drink. You have two options. Albert didn't drink any alcohol or Albert drank any alcohol. Then let's go with the next question. Let's practice with it. Any volunteer to answer the first one? What did you have for breakfast this morning? Any volunteer? Try to answer this question. What did you have for breakfast this morning? This morning? Mm, I ate um, beans, creams, cheese, 
um, a cup of coffee. Very good, cup very good answer. Coffee. Thank you. I have... Soy, soy frijolero, tradicionalista. Uh -huh. Okay, excellent. That was a delicious breakfast. So I have beans, cream, cheese, <laughs> and a cup of coffee. Very good. Y, and a cora de francés. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, next question. What was the last film you saw? What was the last film you saw? ¿Cuál fue la última película que vio? And you say, I saw in the name of the movie. What was the last film you saw? Any answer? I saw We Are Dying. It's a movie. Uh, uh, Encanto. From Korea. Encanto. Oh, okay. Encanto. 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 That is a cute movie, right? Very good pretty, movie. pretty movie. Yeah, it's about the family values, right? And the next one. Who did you last talk to on the telephone? Is asking for a person. Who did you last talk to on the telephone? Who did you last talk to on the telephone? ¿Quién fue la última persona con la que habló en el teléfono o por teléfono? And you say, I talked, I talked on the phone with my... I talked with his girlfriend. Okay, excellent. I talked on the phone with my boyfriend. Thank you. Very good. A any other answer? Who did you last talk on the phone? Any other answer? Ya no hablan por teléfono, solo mensajes en WhatsApp. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with the next question then. What did you last read? What did you last read? ¿Cuál fue el último libro que leyó? ¿Qué fue lo último que leyó? Okay. Then you say, I read a book. I read the newspaper. I read. I read book. Okay, I House read a Spirit. book. <laughs> the House, House of Spirit. I read a, a newspaper. Okay. In the newspaper. Very the newspaper, good. yes. A magazine. Okay, a magazine. I read. I ¿Cómo read sería la respuesta, teacher? Oh, read, say, el I pasado read. de read. Read. I read, read. I, I read, read a book, I, I read, read a, a magazine. magazine, I read the newspaper. Let's go to the next one. What time did you go to bed last night? What time? Es, a qué horas, man? What time did you go to bed yeah. last night? So you say, I went to bed at? At 12 p.m. Okay, excellent answer. I went to bed at? You say 12, 12 p.m.? 12 p.m. 12 p.m. Okay, any other answer? What time did you go to bed last night? Any answer? Oh, estamos en anterior. What time did you go to bed last night? ¿A qué hora se fue a la cama la noche anterior? O anoche. What time did you go to bed last night? And you say, I went to bed at, y la hora, I went to bed at 12, at 11, at 10. At 10 p.m. At 10 p.m. Very good. Let's go with the next one. What did you watch on TV last night? What did you watch on TV last night? ¿Qué vio anoche en la televisión? ¿Cómo se diría la respuesta? I, I watched TV. Watch. Uh, okay. Discovery. I watched, okay, I watched Discovery Channel. I watched uh, watch, uh -huh. oh, TV Discovery Channel. Uh 
Okay, I watch Discovery Channel. Pablo Escobar. Okay, Ooh. the soap opera of Pablo Escobar. <laughs> <laughs> I watch um, Calamar Series. Okay. And after I went to bed at 11 o'clock p.m. Okay. Vio dos capítulos del juego del calamar. <laughs> yes. That's okay. okay. I then... watch Chanel. Uh, it's it's cool. Cool. Bien instructivo. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. Um, Senia, can you please repeat? I watched. Ay, disculpe, que le hable así. Es que como siempre le levanto la mano para hablar y nunca me di ese caso. Ah, perdón. Pero que yo le levantaba la manita y decía, ¿por qué me ignora? Decía. Entonces, ya vi que me tengo que meter ahí a la brava. Yes. Um, I don't okay. know why, right? It is supposed that when you right. raise your virtual hand, um, <laughs> tiene que aparecer un mensajito aquí en la pantalla, but it doesn't happen. It isn't no, working. pero ahorita no lo he hecho. Ah, ok. Desde ayer y ahora ya no lo hice. Yo <laughs> <laughs> estaban hablando de televisión, ¿verdad? Entonces, yes. um, yo le decía que también um, I was, I was um, Shane Discovery and Story. Discovery History. Channel. Discovery Channel. Discovery Channel and History Channel. History Channel. Channel. Very History good, Channel. thank you. Uh, do you remember what was the last photograph you took? What was the last photograph? And also, when did you last see the sea? ¿Cuándo fue la última vez que vio el mar? What did you buy yesterday? ¿Qué compró ayer? What did you buy yesterday? And when was the last meal you cook? ¿Cuál fue la última comida que usted cocinó? Then I have here some possible answer for this question. Just a second. Look at this. What did you have for breakfast this morning? It says, I had beans, green, and cheese. Is it okay if I read the question and you read the answer? Let's see the first one. What did you have for breakfast this morning? Can you please read the answer? I had beans, cream, and beans, cream, and cheese. Thank you very much. Let's see the next one. What was the last field you saw? I saw Spider-Man far from home. Thank you very much. The next question is, who did you last talk on the telephone? Any volunteer to read the answer? Mm, I, I talked I to my mom. Excellent, Julio. Thank you. I talked to my mom. The next one, what did you last read? <laughs> Any volunteer to read the answer? I read Harry Potter book. book. Thank you. The next one, what time did you go to bed? I, I went to bed at, at um, 11. 11. 11. 30. 30. 30. I went to bed at 11.30. Thank you. Let's go to the next one. What did you watch on TV last night? I watched a movie. I watched a movie. I watched. Um, what was the last photograph you took? You say, I took a selfie. Selfie. I took a selfie. When did you last see the sea? I saw, I saw the sea two years ago. Thank you. The next one, what did you buy yesterday? Wow. I bought a... I, I bought a candy. candy. I bought a candy. And the last one, what was the last meal you cooked? And you say, I cooked, I cooked roasted chicken. Roasted chicken. I cook roasted chicken. Very good. So you can practice this question in this answer, right? At home. So practice. In last vacation, these are some past simple questions about your last vacation. Let's see, uh, where did you go on your last vacation? And you say, I went in the place that you visit. Where did you go on your last vacation? Any volunteer to answer this question? 
Where did you go on your last vacation? You are going to use the verb go in past. So you say, I went. I went to Cerro Verde. Thank you. Very good. I went to Cerro Verde. Any other answer? Where did you go on your last vacation? Any other answer? No more answer for this question. Okay, let's go with the next one. What did you do there, Isidro? What did you do there? Um, we hiked. We hiked a lot. Okay, very good. In the next one, how much money did you spend? Um, then just the, a little. Just a little. Okay. I spent just a little. Okay, yeah, you can say I spent one hundred dollars. I wow. spent two hundred dollars. Uh -huh. $80. $80. I spent $80. $80. Uh, who did you go with? He's asking for a person. Who did you go with? Con quien fue? I went with all of my family. Okay, excellent. I went with my family. How many days did you stay there? Just one. I stayed there just one day. I stayed there just one day. Perfect answer. So let's go with the next. These are some simple past questions about parties. Look at this. When did you go to a party? When did you go to a party? ¿Cuándo fue usted a una fiesta? You say, I, I, to went to go, I went to to party on last Saturday. At the time. The last oh. weekend. Okay, a last la, weekend. A, a la fiesta de radio fiesta. <laughs> Fueron. <laughs> the radio fiesta anniversary was the last weekend. Okay, when did you go to a party? So you say, I went to a party last week, last weekend uh, on Saturday. Very good. Uh, who did you go with? Con quien fue? Who did you go with? Luis? Senia. With my friends and, oh. and my wife. With my friends and my wife. Very good. Senia, who did you go with to the party? Um, I went. Espérame, espérame. Ya le digo, este, ¿cómo se llama? Um, ¿Cómo se llama? Karaoke, um, 40, 14 and 20. Karaoke party. Okay, karaoke party. Very good. Let's go with the next one. But the question is, who did you go with? Con quien fue? Con quien fue? Con quien fue? Con quien fue? No sé si lo dije bien o no. Vale, la segunda pregunta es con quién, con quién fue a la, a la fiesta. Who did you go with to the karaoke party? Con quién. And the next one, how did you get there? Again, ¿cómo llegó ahí? And you say, I got there I got, by bus. I got, I got, I got there. And how many people attended the party? ¿Cuántas personas llegaron a esa fiesta? Maybe 100 persons. 100. 100, okay, very good. Now I have the reading part. Let me show you this. You can practice answer this question at home, right? Answering those questions. And let's listen to this. It's about Kelly. Read, we're going to read and then we're going to answer some questions right, about this reading. So pay attention. Right? If you can follow the, the reading as you are listening, it is going to be okay for you to answer the questions. So Kelly, ¿Qué hizo Kelly el fin de semana pasado? Let's listen and read. Listen and read. Weekend stories. Can you listen? Let me know if you can listen. Yes, sir. 
Okay, thank you. Weekend stories. Kelly. I had a great weekend. I went to my best friend Helen's wedding. She got married at home. All her friends and family went. She looked fantastic. She wore a beautiful dress. After the ceremony, her parents served a wonderful meal. I'm really happy for her. And I really like her husband. Do you have any question? Any new vocabulary in this small reading passage? She said, I had a great weekend. I went to my best friend Helen's wedding. She got married at home. All her friends and family went. She looked fantastic. She wore a beautiful dress. After the ceremony, her parents served a wonderful meal. I'm really happy for her. And I really like her husband. Any new vocabulary in this reading? Ya le quería quitar el novio. Oh, oh no. It, um, en este caso, esa oración significaría como me cae muy bien su novio. <laughs> um, so let's see the first question. Did she have an awful weekend? Did she have an awful weekend? Yes, she did. Or no, she didn't. No, she didn't. No, she didn't. No, she didn't, right? She had a great weekend. Let's yes. see. Where, where did she go on the weekend? Where did she go? Where did Kelly go? She went to her uh, wedding, to her best friend wedding. Excellent. He, sorry, she went, she went. Okay, Kelly went to her best friend. Her wedding. best friend. Wedding. 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 wedding ceremony. Did yeah. Helen look fantastic? Did yes. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Excellent yes, answer. Yes. Where, where did Helen get married? Where did Helen get At married? At her home. Okay. Helen got married. Helen got married at home. At her home. Very good. At her home. Who did serve the food? Who did serve the food? Um, where is it? Um, serve it. Um, serve it. Wonderful. Her meal. parents. Okay, Helen's parents. Helen's okay, parents. Helen's parents. Okay, here are the answer. Yes, she did. She went to her best friend's wedding. Yes, she did. She got married at her home. Helen's parents Helen served, parents served, served the, food. the food. Good. Okay. I need to volunteer to practice a question and answer. Any volunteer tonight? Who wants to help me? Okay. Let's do it, teacher. Okay, thank you, Isidro and Alexis. Isidro and Alexis, can you help me, please? It's going to be oh, okay, first. Uh, Isidro, you are going to read the question and Alexis the answers. Okay. We can start practicing. Thank you. Are you ready, Alexis? Okay, here we go. Okay. Did she have an awful weekend? Yes, she did. Did Helen look fantastic? Yes, she did. Oh, me salté una. Where did she go? She went to her best friend wedding. Where did Helen get married? She got married at the home. Who did service the food? Helen's parents server the food. Thank, Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Okay. Served a lot. Served, served, served the food with served. this served. sound. Served. Served. served the food. With this sound at the end. Serve the food and serve, serve it. Food. Get married. Get married. Get okay. married. Okay, yeah, excellent. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Isidro and Alexis. Okay, la disculpamos. Disculpemos la teacher. Okay, <laughs> está disculpada. Uh, let's see, uh, let's go with the next. Weekend I... stories. 
Robert. Let's listen, Robert. What happened with Robert during the last weekend? So listen. Robert, I had an awful weekend. My friends and I went to a rock concert. I had a terrible time. It took three hours to drive there. I didn't like the music at all. And after the concert ended, our car broke down. I called my parents and they came and got us. We finally got home at 10 this morning. I am so tired. Any question, any new vocabulary in this small paragraph? Le fue mal al amigo. Ah, yes. Oh. He had an awful weekend. So I say, yeah. I had an awful weekend. My friends and I went to a rock concert. I have a terrible concert. time. I had a terrible time. It took three hours to drive there. I didn't like the music at all. And after the concert ended, our car broke down. I called my parents and they came and got us. We finally got to home. Sorry, we finally got home at 10 this morning. I am so tired. So what, Terrible. Happened, what happened with him? The Get concert it. was too bad. Okay, it was a very bad weekend for Robert. He went to a concert and he didn't like the music. He didn't like the music at all. And after the concert ended, our car broke down, he said. What is that? Broke down. Do you have Se dañó el vehículo. Se abrió el carro. Se arruinó el vehículo. Muy bien. I called my parents and they came and got us. Or got us. Got us. We, ran, we finally got home at 10 this morning. Llegó a las 10 de la mañana esta mañana. Qué feo. Y tener que pagar y tener que manejar tres horas. Okay. Llegar. Sí, le fue mal. Right. So let's see the question. Did Robert have a good weekend? No, yes, he, he didn't. No, no, he didn't. He, no. No, he, no, he didn't. Right? No, uh, he didn't. Who did he go to the concert with? Who did he go to the concert with? ¿Con quién fue el concierto? With her friends. Okay, with her or with his friends? With his friends. With his friends. Thank you. Let's see the next one. What time did he get out home? What time did he get home? Sorry. What time did he go get home? Three hours. Mm, no, really. He got home at 10. This morning. This morning. Thank you. The next one. Did the car break down? Did the car break yes, down? Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Here are the answers. No, he didn't. He went with his friend. He got home at 10 this morning, and yes, it did. I have the last reading. Robert. Here we go. Erin, Erin. So listen. Beautiful Erin. Erin. I had an interesting weekend. I went camping for the first time. My friends took me. We left on Saturday and drove to the campsite. First, we put up the tent. Then we built a fire, cooked dinner, and told stories. We got up early on Sunday and went fishing. I caught a fish. I didn't really like camping, but I learned a lot. Okay, now I didn't say I had an interesting weekend. I went camping for the first time. My friends took me. We left on Saturday and drove to the campsite. First, we put up the tent. Then we built a fire, cooked dinner, and told stories. We got up early on Sunday and went fishing. I caught a fish. I didn't really, I didn't really like camping, but I learned a lot. So 
How was her weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo su fin de semana? It was pretty good, but she really don't like. Okay. Uh, she doesn't like. She doesn't like. She doesn't something. like. Teacher, yes. uh, what does mean? Uh, uh, we put up the the tent. Le, it is levantamos las tiendas de campaña. Las oh. casitas. Las casitas okay, que we, se arman cuando uno va a acampar. Los toldos, ok. Las campañas. Las Gracias. Ajá, Thank okay. you. Any other question about vocabulary? No more questions? No, everything is clear. Ok, let's see. Here is the first question. How did she get to the campsite? How did she get to the campsite? They dropped. They okay. drop to the campsite. Okay, very good. Uh, what did she do at the camp? What did she do at the campsite? They go fish. Oh, it says she. What did she do at the camp? She go fish. She go. She go or go, she went. She goes fish. Um, she went fish. She went fishing. She went, she fish. went fishing. She went fishing. ¿Qué otra actividad realizó? Any other activity? She cooked the dinner. She built a she fire. Will, she will a fire. Okay, and she told stories. She told. Did she catch a fish? Did she catch a fish? Did she, yes, she caught she catch a fish too. She coach. She cow. Cow coach. She couch fish. Did she like camping? Really, she don't like. She doesn't like. Okay. Uh, how was her weekend? How was her weekend? Interesting. It was interesting. Now here are the answer. And for the first one, she dropped to the campsite. The second one, she put up the tent, she built a fire, she cooked dinner and told stories. No, she didn't. Uh, did she like camping? No, she didn't. And the next one, how was her weekend? She had an interesting weekend. Interesting weekend, yeah. Okay, so in this way, we can uh, tell, right? We can tell how was our weekend. ¿Cómo fue nuestro fin de semana? We can make sentences using um, regular and irregular verbs and simple past tense. Right? Y relatar, bueno, ¿qué sucedió el fin de semana? So keep that in mind. Tomorrow we are going to have a practice about that. So um, prepare at least 10 activities that you did during the weekend. Don't forget about that. Por lo menos 10 actividades que hicieron el fin de semana pasado. ¿De acuerdo? That is hey, okay. <laughs> you can use... See you tomorrow, rap. teacher. Ok. Next. Hey, teacher, se me pasó por alto este, unos problemas de, un, de la place, de la... ¿Cómo se llama? La platform. Pero lo vemos mañana. You can write on the WhatsApp group. Ok. Ah, ok. Se lo mando más tardecito. If you want, we can fix it Good right morning. now. We can check it right now if you want. Thank you. Sí. Eh, le comento, teacher, la verdad es que yo considero que las respuestas están bien, pero no sé por qué ahí me las tira mal. Uh -huh. Le digo la unidad. Yes, please. Sí, nos, nos vamos a la unidad. Uh, es la 412, 4.12. Del Cholex. Knowledge check. Okay. Okay, can you please repeat? 4.12, no. 4.12. 4.12. This way. No, check. Uh -huh. Okay, what's the problem in this part? In this part, I wrote uh, 
did you watch television last night? That was my answer. Is it yes, like that. this one? Did you watch television last night? Sí. Okay. Let's Esa. Es, pero me la, me, la, me la tiró mal. And the other one I, I brought. Did you have dinner last night? Okay, but that is the right answer. Did you have dinner last night? That is correct. Yes. It's like this one. Did you have dinner last night? Eso escribí. And the next one is? And then the last one is? Um, yesterday. Uh, did, did you, you go to work yesterday? Go did to... you go to work yesterday? And the last yes. one? And the, uh, there is the last one. Oh, did they, uh, did they go to the movies on they, Monday? Uh, on Wednesday. Okay. It's on Wednesday. Wednesday. On what? <laughs> yeah, por eso. Bueno, <laughs> bueno <laughs> quizá por eso me la tiran todas malas. <laughs> <laughs> okay. O deben de estar mal escritas. Money, no, pero lo crean. Okay, pero me hubiera tirado por lo menos Isidro, unas tres buenas. Isidro, más, Isidro, Isidro cu question mark. No, si ah. le puse el question mark tú. Ah, Aquí okay. está, le puse, le puse el question mark. You can ah. see it in all of them. Ya Pero es probablemente bien. no sé si lleva punto o qué. La voy a ensayar de nuevo. Ok, uh, don't forget that you have to start with capital letter, y letra mayúscula en la primera. Oh. Diet, diet, it is sure. capital letter. Ahí está el error, ahí está el error. Ah, okay. Ahí está el error en todas, porque la puse con la minúscula, no son capital letters. Ah, ok, then that's why. That is the mistake. <laughs> then. You can Gracias. Now. Ok. Ok, guys, thank you very much. Eh, see you tomorrow at 8 p.m. Have a good night. Bye bye. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Let's watch the, the play soccer. Soccer plays. Okay. <laughs> Vamos a ver el partido. <laughs> ok. <laughs> Okay. Nos queda un segundo tiempo. Vamos a gritar. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. bye.